Hi everyone, in this lesson we're going to be representing data using bar charts, this time focusing on how to read and interpret a bar chart. This topic is part of the data area of maths and it's suitable for children who are 8 years and older. Ok, so what are bar charts? Bar charts are a way of showing information and amounts of something using bars on a chart. Let's quickly look back at the bar chart we made in the previous lesson. So we took all the cars sold in a car dealership. And we put this information into a bar chart with the title cars sold at a car dealership. We put the data set which was the cars down the bottom and then we put in the names of the cars underneath it. We then put the frequency down the side which was the amount of each car sold. Small lines were used to separate out the amounts. With zero down the bottom, then skip counting in twos, we put all the numbers in up to 16, which was the largest number we needed. From there, the bar chart was filled in using the data from the car dealership, which resulted in a bar chart looking like this. Now I'd like to see if you can answer these questions. Ok, question number 1. How many Toyotas were sold? Question 2. How many Fords were sold? And question 3. How many Tezas were sold? Press pause, see if you can answer these questions, then press play when you are ready. Ok, how many Toyotas were sold? If we use the bar to count up in twos, we will count 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. There were 16 Toyotas sold altogether at the dealership. How many Fords were sold? Well, if we do the same thing, we're going to count up to 10. There were 10 Fords sold altogether. And finally, how many Teslas were sold? If we look at the top of the bar, we'll see there were 8 Teslas sold. Well done! Time now for just three more questions. These are a little bit more challenging. Question number 4. How many more Toyotas than Volkswagens were sold? Question number 5. How many fewer Fords than Toyotas were sold? And question 6. How many cars were sold altogether? Press pause, see if you can answer these questions, then press play when you are ready. Ok, question 4. How many more Toyotas than Volkswagens were sold? So if we have a look here, over from the arrow, from the Toyotas, over to the Volkswagen, and then we count in twos. So two, four, we'll see that there's four more Toyotas than Volkswagens sold, because the difference is four. Okay, question five, how many fewer Fords than Toyotas were sold? So if again, if we go up to the Toyota, and then we count in twos, two, four, six, Altogether, there were six fewer Fords than Toyotas sold, because the difference is six. And finally, how many cars were sold altogether? Well, if you count the 12, plus 16, plus the 10, plus the 8, you will, of course, get 46. There were 46 cars sold altogether. Excellent work. You've learned how to read and interpret data from a bar chart. Keep up the great work. See you soon. Thank you for watching. If you can think of somebody who might find this video helpful, please share it with them. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe.